guys, my name is Svenja and welcome to a brand new game to the channel. We are going to start playing A Short Hike, which I'm very excited about um, here in this lovely little start sequence. I just want to give you a quick rundown of what this game supposedly is about and how I found out about it. I have not played this, I have not looked at any trailers or anything, I literally stumbled across it in a YouTube video which is titled Six Indie Games That Will Bring You Joy by the lovely Ellen, um, who has an amazing channel called Gamer Latte. I'm gonna link that video and her channel in the description down below. I definitely recommend checking that out. She works in the game industry as well and just has a very interesting eye for all these things and just the way she talks about them is really cool. And yeah, I mentioned I'd never heard of this before. And lucky for me, this game is in the switch store which is really good and the only thing i did look at because i just wanted to see when this came out so i went on the, their website it first came out in 2019 and their little description of it is a little exploration game about hiking up a mountain hike climb and soar through the peaceful mountainside landscapes of hawk peak provincial park follow the marked trails or explore the backcountry as you make your way to the summit along the way meet other hikers discover hidden treasure and take in the world around you Online it also says it takes about an hour and a half to four hours to complete the game depending on how much of a completionist run you want on it. And yeah, I guess that's just something I want to find out for myself while I play it. I just really feel like I want to give these small indie games more of a chance and I just don't take the time for them as much and I appreciate that they are kind of a little bit of like a cleanse and they just, yeah, they just work different and I'm really much looking forward to it. So. I can't wait to play this with you guys. And yeah, of course, we're gonna start a new game here. I never get tired of this view. Claire? You're gonna have a great time here this summer. I think. It'll be good to get away from the city. And take a break from everything else going on. Are you still awake? Mm. Maybe. Hold on a little longer. We're almost at the ferry. Oh, that looks so cute. And that... I've never seen this kind of pixel style in a video game before, which is exciting. Okay, so let's see. So we're this little penguin bird. I think we're Claire, right? And okay, so that's controls. Oh, we can jump as well. And then, okay. <laughs> Cell phone, it's useless without reception. Not even the games work offline. <laughs> okay. And this was the jump button. Okay. I'm just I'm just gonna go for a little walk around and see what there is. Um, I mean the game most definitely wants me to go to the campfire, doesn't it? But <laughs> as usual. Oh we can swim? Oh my god, I love it. Oh my god, I love it. Oh, there's a Oh <gasps> You found a shell! of course is the traditional path again of what I probably should be doing but I'm just like nah mate oh, <laughs> I'll take off and now I can't stop like I'm just like oh I should probably go back but now I want to explore here who are you yo this updraft is on point you can get some sick dives on it how do you dive? Oh dang, it's easy. But it takes some practice. You gotta hear me out. First, you gotta be gliding. As you know, you glide by holding A. Okay, we did another, that's new, that's cool. Then, if you're high enough off the ground, release your joystick to dive downward. Oh, that's definitely gonna take some <laughs> getting used to. But you must still remember to hold A. That's the tricky part. With a good dive, you can build up lots of speed. 
You can practice by gliding over this updraft. That will give you a lot of height to work with. Can we just walk up it? Oh, we can. Okay, let me just peruse around the island. And... Okay, there's nothing else. Oh, I can... Oh, okay. Oh, look at us! That is so cool. I'm already enjoying this. Oh, help. <laughs> I want to. I want to go over here. I. S I know that there was a treasure chest at the start, and I do kind of want to go back to where we started. Hey, you found a coin. Oh look, we've got eighteen coins now. I really don't. Can we pick fish? No. Okay. <laughs> there is so much. Yeah, I don't know how much. How enjoyable this is as a as a backseat gamer. I personally, how I mentioned, this should just be like a little bit of a cleanse for us. Um, and just, I just really wanted to try out something completely new. And that's kind of what I'm doing here. And maybe that's, uh, you'll enjoy that. I personally don't like my voice that much. But I've been told it's it's decent for reading and stuff like that, so maybe maybe you'll enjoy it. Okay, who are you? Hey, how's it going? I haven't seen you all day. You've been busy? Hmm, kinda. Oh, not really. I've just been waiting around for a call. Well, <laughs> there's your problem. There's no reception out here. Wait? What? Yeah, I mean pretty much no reception. You might be able to get some at a whole peak. Ah, yeah, I guess. But that's pretty far, isn't it? It's not that far. We've all made the trek before. I figured you would have gone already. Oh, yeah. I've been meaning to go, but I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Well, today's as good as a day as any. Just take White Beach Trail and head north at the fork. Then follow the signs for Hawk Peak. No problem. Okay. <laughs> I guess this this is the kind of like our generation problem of, well, I don't have a I don't have reception, and that is kind of the thing that actually ma makes hey <laughs> makes us get out. White Coast Trail, Ranger's Cabin. Okay. Oh, so I guess this is the kind of first part where we're just meant to like get to know how the controls work. And this is kind of how I can move the camera. Okay, cool. Claire! Did you know you can hold A while running to glide through the air? <laughs> of course. Everyone knows that. Why do you ask? I don't know. I just had a feeling you might want to know. Um... Okay. <laughs> well, little friend, we didn't know until basically just now. So it's very understandable. Oh, that was a coin. Okay, cool. Let's go all the way from the top. Whee! This makes me miss, like, just traveling and getting out. Have you guys had the chance to travel anywhere recently? Probably not because of all the situation going on right now. But what was the last trip you took? And also have you ever been camping? That would be really interesting to hear. I quite enjoy camping myself. Oh, who are you? Hey you! Find me 15 shells. <laughs> what? Why? I want them! Yeah, but why? It's a secret. <laughs> okay. I'll keep an eye out. Keep both eyes out, please. She really wants... Oh, a stick. She really wants the, the shells, doesn't she? He, it, they. Let's go with they. Um, What can we do with the, the stick? And also... Ah, okay, so now I can go into the inventory... And it actually tells me about this stuff as well. If 
five shells. It sparkles in the sun, but is otherwise pretty boring. Oh, come on, shells aren't boring. Coins. It's money. Great for buying stuff and feeling secure. Stick. A wooden stick. Not sure why I picked this up. Well, this is probably come in handy eventually. Oh, a cabin. Ranger's cabin. White Coast Trail. <laughs> oh, he's just pressing against it. So we kind of want to go down to the right here, but I want to see what's down here first. What is that? Oh, coins. People really <laughs> just leave their stuff laying around here. Okay. Oh, so we can do like a little round track. But now I feel like I might have missed something. Okay. I could have gone around as well. So that's what I'll do next. And here, here. Come on, jump. We'll grab the shell. And then we have another chest. What's in here? More money. Nice. And a froggo. Love of love frogs. <laughs> hey dude. What's happening? Oh, you know. Just jamming out on the beach. Building sand castles and whatnot. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. You know it. Can I borrow your shovel? Sorry, bud. I need it for sand castle construction. <laughs> Isn't it a little big for that? Yeah, but that's just how shovels are. You can get smaller ones. Ones made for sand castles. What? Sounds fake. But if you can show me one, I'd be glad to trade. Okay, so my dude over here would like a smaller shovel. I kind of want to before we... Ooh. Oh, that's what we want the shovel for. Okay. And this is kind of the trail we would have gone. I told you we would have missed something. More coins, I guess? Or is there other stuff in there as well? More coins. That's pretty cool, though. Can we shortcut? Or do I need to go... The Ooh. Ooh. I can shortcut over here. Fair enough. I can't do anything with that. Okay. We went over here. And now let's have a look over here. That looks like a pretty cool playground. Hey there. What are you up to today? Um, I'm hiking up to Hawk Peak. That's a tough hike, you know. You'll need to learn to rock climb to make it up the top. Why not join our rock climbing club? Uh, oh. Is it just the two of you? Hey! Rock Climbing Association was hundreds of members spanning over 35 countries worldwide. Hundreds of members growing and refining the art of rock climbing. I actually think I'm part of that. <laughs> like in real life. <laughs> Pushing the craft to its absolute limit and beyond. Uh, I meant... If it's just the two of you, like, here? What of it? Listen, kid. Climbing ain't for the weak of heart. Most people don't have what it takes. Um, it's not really that bad. So anyway, <laughs> you want to join the Climbs Club? Yeah. Great. We've just got a third member. <laughs> so much to that. Not third, just another drop. In the hundreds worldwide. Alright, alright. Anyway, um, so first things first. You got a golden feather? N no. Oh, not yet. Ah, you can't climb without one. But you can buy them at the visitor center. They should be pretty cheap. Come back when you've bought one. Okay, so we gotta go to the visitor centers and buy a golden... What was it? A golden feather. Hawks Peak Trail. White Coast Trail. Side Beach Visitor Center. Okay, so we gotta go down here. Because if he says we can't get up to Hawks Peak without... Ooh. And we should remember that as well. Oh, hi. I've heard some rumors. Do you like rumors? I dabble. 
Okay, hear me out. Jim just bought a metal detector. He was running around yesterday, looking for stuff around the island. It was going nuts, though. It seems like there's stuff buried all over the island. What kind of stuff? I don't know. Metal stuff? <laughs> really? <laughs> you don't say. <gasps> oh, I thought I saw an island, but it was just the shadow of the deep water. I hope we have enough coins for a feather. They said it wouldn't be too expensive, so... Let's just hope, I suppose? Ooh. More coins. And more shells. We almost got 10, nice. Did he want 10 or 15? <laughs> Keep on forgetting those kind of things. This looks pretty cool as well. If we can start to fish, maybe? Visitor Center and Hawk Peak Trail. Side Sid Beach, Shirley's Point. So I guess we'll go up to the visitor center. What is this? <gasps> there is a golden feather. <laughs> I want the golden feather. <laughs> That's just mean, really. Hello? Eh, let me have it. Can I sail down somewhere? Okay, let me see. Boop, 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 boop. Can't even get up here, seriously? Okay. Fly, fly, fly. Oh, that was so close. I guess we'll just actually go to the visitor center. I still have to kind of settle into that, like, chill mindset. <laughs> I'm not used to those kind of games anymore. Who are you? Howdy. How can I help you? I heard you sell golden feathers here. Oh, we do. You can buy one. 40 coins. What else do you say? We also sell provincial park merchandise. We're kind of low on stock, but that's good actually. It's been a busy season. Provincial park must be trending or something. It's possible. Anyway, we only have one hat left. Oh, I can't afford that. It costs 100 coins. Now I'll pass. Okay. But we do want the feather. Do they... Like, does a feather get used up? Or why was it another one? Sure, here you go. You found a golden feather. Let me explain how they work. If you press A while in midair, you can flap your wings for a double jump. But that's not all. To climb a wall, push against it and hold A. The more golden feathers you have, the more you'll be able to climb and fly. Oh, okay. Have fun out there. <clears throat> Sorry. I think my voice cracked there. That's pretty cool. So we can... Oh, so I have one, so I can do one flap, I guess? <gasps> no, no, no. I'm not falling off, please. I want to see if we can get the get this one right away. again yeah you found a golden feather oh look at us ah that's another thing we would have to dig up some coins <gasps> we found a small shovel that wasn't too bad you found a toy shovel and I found some more coins as well what's that up there Okay. Whee! <laughs> that is so cute. That's just such a cute mechanic. I'd like... I don't even... Like, I'm tr in my brain, I'm trying to kind of compare it to something. Have we talked? There's going to be a marathon race at Meteor Lake today. The competition this year is fierce. Okay. I guess it's kind of like with, with the animal... like point in mind it's probably like animal crossing -y a little bit but like from the the aspects of it i wouldn't say it's like that at all hi what's your painting oh you can't tell um it's supposed to be the coastline 
Though I'm trying to go for a more abstract look. Huh. I think I can see it now. It's still a work in progress, but I don't know if I like where it's going. I think I'm gonna head over to the Backwood Forest Lighthouse soon. I'm still trying to find the right inspiration. Okay. Whee. Yeah, I just wanna go back so we can grab the shovel. Um, because apparently then, like I thought it was a one, one time thing. Now I've found like several of the, the little buried ooh, crosses. Ooh, also if we can get the hat beforehand, like before we start our hike, I'm, I'm gonna go get the hat. So maybe we look like a little ranger as well. Okay, where was the dude with the, here, hi. Hey, check out the shovel I found. It might be a little more your size. Ah, oh, that's perfect. Let's trade. You found a shovel. When you want to use my shovel, press Y to open your inventory and equip it. Keep it fresh. Um, press B to dig. Press B to dig. Okay. Um, B. Oh no! <laughs> what happened? B. Oh, cool. Nice. Where else did I see? I think it was along the path, wasn't it? That is so cute. <laughs> so you had to go- Oh, we can do the climbing thing now as well. My sand- Oh, cute. My sand castle is now part of a sand city. And also, I'm running into a hotly contested election for mayor. Oh, hold on. The election results are just coming in. Okay, okay. I'm telling them up. <gasps> Third place. What? I built this city. So here, now we want to climb. You got a golden feather? Yep. Great. So to get started, you can try climbing the short wall here. Just push against the wall and hold A. Nice one. Whatever. <laughs> that climb is easy. Real pros use the big wall. <laughs> You're a bloody squirrel, mate. Of course. <laughs> I'm just sliding down. Oh, well, let's try that again. You, if you're having trouble with the wall, just watch my technique. It's highly refined from years of climbing. I don't really know. Oh. If you have, yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Look, I just wanted to climb myself. <gasps> Can we make it? Oh, no. Let's try again. Bloop, bloop, bloop. Whoa, good climbing. Uh, it was alright. So, I know you can fly and all, but your stamina will last longer if you climb places instead. Just something to keep in mind. So what's next? To Haw Peak. Oh, okay. I still need to warm up myself, but I'll see you up there. All right. <laughs> no, um, regarding the climbing thing, I uh, lived in Canada for half a year. And there I actually had a big climbing gym in our high school, which was super cool and like so much fun. And I'd spend a lot of time there. So like I actually have one class, which was called Recman. And uh, so recreational management where we would learn how to climb ourselves. And then um, four out of five days classes from like, um, like younger classes and special, um, like what's it like? It's a special ed. People with disabilities um, would come in and we would like teach them how to climb and supervise it and climb with them and, and it was so much fun and then I was also in the climbing team so I just did a lot of climbing. Um, oh wait, excuse me, do you have the time? Ah, yeah, let me check. See, normally I would know the time. I just lost my watch. Uh oh, sorry. It was very expensive and priceless when you consider the sentimental value. I see. If you find it, can you bring it back to me? Sure. 
please don't sell it on the internet or whatever. It's very valuable to me. No, don't worry. I'll bring it right back. Okay, thanks. That's another thing too. Is it this? Um, no, I just really enjoyed it. It was so much fun. I'd never really done it like that before. Um, and I, yeah, I just absolutely fell in love with it. I've also never had as much upper body strength as I had at that time, which was quite cool as well. I really, I really do miss that. Oh, oh, the way forward is blocked. Okay, so there's a cave down here. I'm wondering if we, if we're gonna get like a map or something, because that would really help me. I'm already lost. Do we have how much? We need six more, then I can get the... I was gonna say helmet. <laughs> the hat. No, and, uh, I, and I actually competed in like climbing competitions and stuff as well. And for that, you had to join the climbing association. So that's kind of... Oh. Oh. What I meant there. It's just really cool times. I really enjoyed that. Oh, let's get a hat. <laughs> Up here. Hi, I would like a cool hat, please. Howdy. What's up? Can I... Oh, I can buy more of them. I, uh, hmm. I think I want the hat first. I feel like we might find some more feathers. We only have one hat left. It costs 100 coins. I'll take it. You found a provincial park hat. Why don't you try it on? Hello, I want to try it on. Stylish and practical. It says support of provincial parks on it. Where? Oh, look at us. We're so, <laughs> so cute. As also, I just looked over to the side. Uh, we're currently at about 30 minutes. I think um, about like a good 45 be nice for this uh but yeah let me know in the comments what you think also let me know if you um like this game if you are not interested in watching even though i'm pretty like i'm sorry but i'm pretty sure i've already made my choice regarding that i would love to continue playing this i'm having a great time <laughs> um i don't know if i went into this with that high expectations i was kind of looking forward to it and i just like went into it with a pretty neutral outlook I think and so far I'm already enjoying it so much. Dear sign reader, hi. I don't know you but you're probably pretty cool. I'm cool too. We should race each other. It would be cool. Biadi. I'm gonna set up a ribbon at the lighthouse. Avery. Okay. Gotta find our way to the lighthouse I suppose. <gasps> oh. Didn't mean to. Oh, do you? Oh, I can see that. Whip. There it is. Okay. <laughs> I'm just absolutely not following the path. I've already in adventure mode, and the island's just too cute. I can't. But I guess like how the website said if everything fails should, not, should only take us four hours um, also if you are interested in that kind of stuff I am always uh, I'm playing this on my switch so it is in the switch store for I think I paid 6 99 in euros for it um, you could probably wishlist it and wait for it to... Oh, I didn't think I would make that. <laughs> oh god. Um, for it to come on sale? Is that the watch? Hello? Oh no, it's not. Um, I also know that it is on Steam, so if you don't have a Switch, um, you could probably play it on whatever you got your steam stuff on 
and I do feel like I should maybe follow the path a little better. <laughs> um, and yeah, I always reckon it's quite nice to support things like these um, the little indie games. They really are just like so important for actually pushing gaming forward as well. I feel like we sometimes find ourselves a little like lost in the things we know and like the kind of habits and everything and I just feel like it's important to kind of embrace differences and inspire others to think outside the box as well. Okay, Hawk Peak Trail and Good Creek Path. Royal Ridge and Blackwood Trail. Oh, that's cool. Oh, so I think that's the ranger's cabin where we got a hat. And then trees. I'm wondering what are they, are they like, what's, what's the word? Boys? The little floaty things for ships? Can't see anything. Oh wait, hawks. Royal Blackwatch. I think I want to go past here for. <gasps> oh, more coins. I also want to see our buddy again who wanted the shells. I kind of forgot what they looked like though. Was it you? Hmm. I was planning on hiking to Hawk Peak, but the path suddenly got really steep. Do you think it's climbable? Well, I would be if I had a golden feather. Apparently they sell them at the visitor center. We got one of them. Aren't we fancy? What's this? This looks like there's something hidden down here. Apparently not. Hello? Are we just at the start again? Oh, you were the one with the shells, hey? So what's the deal with the shells? It's none of your business, except for the business of you getting me 15. Oh, 15 was it? How many do we have? 12, so we're missing three. Okay, but now I'll definitely remember that we have to go here. Okay. So let's actually follow the path now, shall we? She said, falling off. <laughs> can we do something? <gasps> I can do it for... Hi! Hee <laughs> Okay, we'll, we'll just actually kind of like... Make our way up a little bit, I suppose. And just see what happens, see who we come across. <gasps> oh, I mean, that's not the worst thing that could have happened. We literally found a chest because of it, which is pretty cool. Yeah, we'll just take this path. So we were down here and then we want to go over here. That was locked off, they said. So we'll probably be able to go back here a little later. Just <laughs> gotta try and remember it. What's this say? Hawk Peak Trail. Notice. Hawk Peak Trail is a strenuous hike. Didn't the other bird, is it a mother? A parent? I don't know. Tell us it wasn't that hard. <laughs> you might need golden feathers to complete it. Golden feathers are for sale at the visitor center. Is this basically just telling me I should buy more golden feathers? No, oh, I'm a little worried. Oh, okay. Because <laughs> we've got two, which is pretty good. I guess... How much do we have? I mean, like, honestly, if we're already here, we might as well just grab another one as well. Whee! <laughs> Looking sharp in that hat! What's up? Well, I would like to buy another golden feather. Sure, here you go. You found a golden feather. That's actually all the feathers we have. A boy came by earlier and bought most of our remaining stock. You'll have to find more elsewhere. Sorry. <laughs> it's probably the squirrel that is like making fun or was trying to make fun of us. 
for only being able to climb the small wall. <laughs> I could see that. But at least now we have all the ones he was selling. So that's pretty good. Don't feel like, ah, oh, I missed out on anything. And we've been doing pretty well on the coins, so I don't feel like... <gasps> oh, Lord. <laughs> Balancing. Oh, wait, is that... Oh, that's this one. We had just hadn't walked across it yet. Okay, fair enough. We'll be up here. And then, what is that? Oh, I think we already opened that one down there. This looks so pretty. <laughs> Let's have a look over here. <laughs> Just little spirals. Oh yeah, we fell down there and saw the chest. So how do golden feathers work? Well, when you've got one in your pocket, you'll feel much lighter. That makes it easier to climb up cliffs. Whoa, that's pretty cool. It's indeed. Well, now I want a golden feather. <laughs> Blackwood Trail, Hawks Peak Trail. Okay, yeah, that's where we were as well. Uh, hmm. Hi. Hi. Uh, are you okay? Hmm? Not really. I'm supposed to run a marathon race today, but I've lost my lucky headband. I've worn it to every race I've ever run. I... I don't know if I could race without it. Where'd you lose it? Somewhere in Blackwood Forest. I think. I could take a look for you. Really? You'd do that for me? Sure. It's a red headband. I can give you a reward. I could give you a pair of running shoes. Ooh. Don't you need those yourself? Well... I just got sponsored by this shoe company. <laughs> Who is the shoe company? They gave me like 10 pairs. Whoa. Congrats. Oh, <laughs> thanks. But um, let me know if you see a red headband. Okay, so we've got a red headband we need to find. And a watch. This looks a little bit like it could be that forest. <laughs> I was like, are you okay? Headband. <laughs> Are you here? We've got someone missing you dearly. Oh, we found another feather. We found a golden feather. Okay. And I saw some coins over here as well. Yeah, nice. Hmm. Okay. I don't actually know if I'm right though, so. Climby, climby, climb. I just saw the coins up here, that's why. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> I'm definitely just running backwards and forwards, aren't I? Okay, that's Hawks. Blackwood Trail. I mean, he said Blackwood Woods, right? So, let's actually go through here. And kind of see what there was. <gasps> Mister, you are wearing a red headband. Uh-oh. Weird question, but where do you get that headband? Uh, I don't know. I've had it for ages. Why? Ah, uh, well... I was just talking to this rabbit. She said she lost her headband somewhere in the forest. Oh, you mean Sue? Maybe. I didn't get her name. She was really worried about it, though. She said it was lucky and she needs it to race. I'm supposed to raise her later today. She's so talented. I've been really looking forward to it. Hmm. What if I gave you mine? I'm pretty sure it's the same kind. Maybe she wouldn't notice? Oh, um... But then it wouldn't be lucky. Oh, I don't know. Just take it. She if she wants it. I found a headband. Okay. I do feel like we should. I mean, with lucky things, a lot of the time it's the meaning you associate with them. So 
this could be just just as lucky basically but I do feel bad not telling you let's see what we do any luck finding my headband well I found this hmm that's not it the sweat stains on in the right places Ew. Where did you find this? Actually, the turtle gave it to me. They said you could have it. They're looking forward to the race and didn't want you to miss it. What? Really? Taylor the turtle? They're like the regional champion. This has head. This headband has to be like at least twice as lucky. Possibly even quadruple lucky. Okay, I'll take it. It's, I'm so pumped. Take these running shoes. You found it. Running shoes. You can hold X to run with them. However, just keep in mind that running requires golden feathers. Oh, look at us. <laughs> That's so cool. So, do we have anything? I kind of feel like there should be something hidden in here, right? It's kind of like off the beaten track. It doesn't look like it though. Bummer. It's worth a try. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> Taylor the turtle. Good old Taylor. There's, there's a coin over here, so should we try and climb it? Oh. Okay. Ooh. Up. Bloop, 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 bloop. Look at us with our four feathers. Going strong. Oh, okay. I don't want to land in the, <laughs> the water. Oh well. Have we been down there? I feel like we haven't. Don't want to go all the way to the bottom again. Hey, it's you again. Yep. Classic me again. So, what do you think about this so far? Whoa, this is really good. It's like better than real life. <laughs> well, I don't think I can compete with real life, but I am happy with it so far. I don't know if it will fit into my exhibit though. I'm trying to come up with something more interesting. I'm gonna follow one of these rivers up to its source. I have an idea for a painting from that perspective. That sounds really good. It makes me want to get out and paint again. Also live painting. It's such a like lovely thing, but I just do it so rarely. Last time I did it was um, actually a, a life drawing class through my uni and I drew a bunch of naked people <laughs> but actually like I find it quite wonderful like the human body is such a wondrous beautiful thing and also we had such like oh I'm not gonna make that now am I okay maybe if I come from the side up here um, different like body types and stuff as well we all have like it's I don't know it's just gorgeous even though I do find it easier to make females like look aesthetic if that makes any sense okay I can't get up here yet I can't quite get up there yet but I feel like we we, we will eventually Right? There's Taylor the turtle running his rounds. Okay, we'll, we'll just venture off to the right here first and see where it takes us. Meteor Lake Overlook, Hawk Peak Trail, Blackwood Trail. Oh, I just want to go everywhere. But we go to the water here. Oh, <laughs> that's pretty. What is that? Can we push it out? Is it like a bottle? Oh, <laughs> you're fishing. Sorry, mate. I didn't see that. Yeah. How about we push it towards the fish? Yeah. Fishy, fishy, fish. Come and have a bite. <laughs> Sorry if I disturb your catching there, mate. 
How's it going? Good. The fish are biting today. Cool, cool. So, um, is fishing hard? Nope. It's easy. I could show you if you'd like. Yeah. Here. I'll lend you my spare rod. You found a fishing rod. Casting your line is pretty easy. Just press B. Oh, okay. And what now? <laughs> oh, look, we sit down. So, um, what do I do now? You wait. Oh, okay. Um, am I doing this right? Yep. Maybe I should cast it again, you know? Find a better spot? This spot is good. I saw some fish around here earlier. That's a good sign. Sometimes you just gotta wait. Patience is key. Hmm. <laughs> Not my strong suit. <laughs> we really don't want to sit still, do we? <gasps> Look alive. A fish is nibbling. Should I pull it out? Not yet. You gotta wait for it to bite. What do I do then? Do I press B? Now. Press B. Ooh. What do I do now? Pull back and tap B to reel it in. Oh. That was the wrong back. <laughs> hmm. Interesting technique. This was just an accident. That's all right. Just give it another shot. And remember, once you've hooked the fish, pull back and tap B to reel in. Well, oh. I would say we're gonna give fishing another go, but we'll do that in the next episode. I'm honestly really enjoying this game. I hope you guys are too. If, if you are, let me know by leaving a like. Um, let me know in the comments maybe if you've ever heard of this game before, if you played it yourself. Um, definitely check out the lovely Ellen. She makes amazing videos and she works in the game industry and always has a really interesting and cool point of view on games. And yeah, until next time, I'm gonna say bye. Have a lovely time. Bye.